The neighborhood is stunned tonight as a suspected gunman was captured on a northwest Portland rooftop. 31-year-old Rico Carlos Newman made his first court appearance today. He's charged with attempted murder, robbery, and burglary. And detectives say he shot a man at a northwest Portland apartment building this weekend. Coin Local 6 reporter Lisa Balick is in northwest Portland where this all happened. And Lisa, what prompted this? They don't exactly know, but there was a robbery involved for sure. Now, friends of the victim say that they don't believe that he knew Newman, who ended up right here on top of this roof, but Newman certainly has a criminal record. We heard gunshots go off, and my son raced down the stairs to find out who, where they were coming from. And Tammy Martin couldn't believe what was unfolding right outside her front door here on Northwest 26. Her teenage son went running outside. My son saw the guy. He's like, get back to your house unless you want to get shot, too. My son's like, I'm backing off, I'm backing off. While Rico Newman was running to get away, witnesses living at the Fairmount Apartments tell me they ran to help their 40-year-old neighbor who was shot in the midsection and his leg in an enclosed courtyard of the complex. They say the robbery and assault started inside of the victim's apartment and then ended outside. It's pretty kind of horrifying to hear what was going on. Neighbors say Newman ran up this street then down a few houses on Thurman. He jumped on a house over there, too. Neighbors saw him scale a car, then a fence to jump onto the roof of the Thurman Market. Police used a flashbang grenade to try and get him down, but they finally had to go up to arrest him. Clearly, from his court appearance today in a wheelchair, Newman was injured during his attempted escape. Friends of the victim say he is a friendly guy and don't believe he was acquainted with Newman. I know a lot of the people he kind of knew. I've seen a lot of the people like that in the building. I saw the guy's picture online, and I didn't... I've never seen it before, so I think it was just kind of a random incident. Now, the victim is in serious condition, and we understand from friends here that they want to hopefully visit him very soon. As far as Newman, he is behind bars, held on a lot of bail tonight, that's for sure. Reporting for you live in Northwest Portland, Lisa Balick, Coin Local 6.